everyone welcome back to my channel tech and art hope you guys doing good today i'm going to talk about you know how to take a number of database backup in one shot okay so before starting the session i would request to each and everyone who are newly joined our channel please like to subscribe and don't forget to share if you want to appreciate the effort you can you know uh, join as a member by clicking the join button so let me describe a scenario basically uh, so uh, normally we required to you know take the backups of uh, multiple database while doing the patchings okay so before patching we need to take a database backup so let's assume a particular sql server instance having 100 database okay so you if you go manually it will take time uh, either you can go with the script or you know uh, you can schedule a maintenance task so in a one shot you can you know uh, take a backup of all the databases whatever the database required okay and uh, normally uh, while doing the decommission uh, for a particular instance so before decommission we need to take a backup you need to keep the backup for safer side so in that time also we require this kind of activities okay so let me start uh, so let me connect my manage studio so for the time saving i'm going to take only two database okay so we'll see how to do that actually so you need to create a maintenance jobs for that so you need to go to management okay under the maintenance plan you can click on a wizard okay so next and here you can give a name like a backup okay you can schedule a jobs uh, by changing this here according to your need but I'm going to take ad hoc so I will take the backup and later I will delete this task okay because it's a one-time activity okay so I'm leaving as it is if you want to change you can go and change it if you want to you know uh, do the automation right you know let's assume in a night uh, 12 p.m. you want to start the backups of all the database so you can schedule a timing here automatically it will start taking the backups okay but I'm going to take backup right away. So that's the reason I'm leaving. Okay. So click on next and here you can go with the full backups. Apart from full backup, you can see a lot of maintenance tasks is here. You can choose, uh, you can create a separate task for each and in every individuals. Click on the next and then here it will ask two, four things. You want to all database backups or the only system all users or any specific backup uh, a specific database so i'm going to all users database only excluding the uh, you know system database make sure when you uh, do the any patchings and all you can go with the all database backups okay so for the time saving i'm just choosing the only two backups or two database backups okay click on okay and here one more thing if you check this box it will ignore whatever the database is offline mode okay so in my instance no any database is in offline if you uh, do the checks if you have a 200 database better you can select this checkbox okay click on okay and uh, here things is uh, you know uh, the destination uh, you can see the backups will be created here under directory if you want any specific location you can give it here and if you check this box it will create a separate folder for with the name of database okay extension as it is and if you come to option i'm leaving this tab by default you can either you can change it with uh, you know compressed backups and all the backup set you can um, create a you know expiry dates and all you can go with the copy only backup so a lot of things here but as of now i'm going to default okay click on the next you can keep this location because log is going to write in this location so later you can verify click on the next and then finish okay so it will take couple of second to execute i uh, yes to close to close to close to close and if you come here and refresh the jobs okay if you can see here um, backups jobs created so if you go right click and start the jobs let me start if you will start fully it will start taking the backups okay uh, we'll verify the location we'll verify the location where the backup is placed let me open actually uh, yes as I can see or it's already started once it will done I will verify 
okay hopefully you can see my screen the job is success completed and if you close you can see here right the two folders created with the same name backups uh, tech01 under that you can see the backup file okay and the same tech02 you can see the backup file of database tech02 okay so it's created a separate folder with the name of database because i have selected the checkbox okay so through this way you can you know create a maintenance task no need to worry to take the backups and also it's like you know morning 6:30 you are going to apply the patch okay so you have a let's assume 100 database on a particular instance so you can create a one time maintenance activity this backup task prior to 6:30 and it will once you start the patching before that it will your backup will be ready okay so it's like kind of automation you can also do that well that's it for today we'll meet you soon guys thank you bye bye